Leslie Meredith with Breakbulk Events and Media, and I'm joined in the studio here at Breakbulk Middle East with um, Matteo Polaris from Petrofac, who's just finished um, a panel uh, talking about a Project Cargo case study here in the UAE um, that was particularly complex, very complex, right? So maybe give us an overview of that. Well, Zatko is a project on offshore, 80 kilometers offshore of Abu Dhabi, on for uh, artificial island, uh, and uh, the, the project is called UZ750, so Upper Zakum 750, and uh, the goal is to increase the production capacity of the Upper Zakum field from the current uh, 550,000 barrels per day to 750,000 sustainable for 25 uh, years. So the project is ongoing uh, and... Uh, but it was an interesting solution, I think, that you came up with, the islands yeah. versus... Uh, yeah, the convention, basically... You had a couple of options that yes, you looked at. Yes, basically, Zatko, uh, the, the first phase of production, up to 500,000 barrels, was through wallet platform uh, connected to centered uh, facility for processing and then uh, this uh, process facility ship the oil through flow line to Zirku Island. The, the option of increasing the production capacity has moved uh, from this uh, wallet platform to a uh, small uh, artificial island. This uh, option was feasible because uh, the field is in a very shallow area, around eight to nine meters uh, of, uh, of water depth. And with the technology that uh, were imported for the first time in UAE in terms of drilling, like extended drilling uh, technology that allow to um, produce oil from the wellhead up to 10 kilometers away from the actually wellhead of the, of the well. So this uh, is enabled with the uh, uh, drilling uh, <coughs> cluster in a very small island to then uh, uh, go and uh, produce the oil from a basically 10 to 15 kilometers radius away from the well. And what, was the, what were the benefits of doing it that way? Well, doing the weight, you basically minimize your capex because now uh, the investment of uh, Zatko from uh, the potential 25 uh, wellet platform that were required uh, to increase the capacity from 550 to 750 to the smaller island, so their capex investment has been reduced and minimized. They have a, a small, probably, increase of cost in drilling on the long term, but the increased production capacity will compensate that cost of drilling on a, on a long term scale that is almost minimum 25 years. There are rumors that the, the extent, the, the the drilling technology will allow to probably extend the reservoir uh, production for additional 10 to 15 years, but these are uh, not confirmed yet. So there is drilling technology that uh, produ production technology that Exxon and uh, Adnoc they, they are using to definitely try to increase the possible revenue of the reservoir that is estimating around 50 billion barrels uh, in 25 okay. years. So. <clears throat> talking a little bit about um, the drop in oil prices and how that's affecting project development, certainly putting a lot of pressure um, on our industry. But is there, but are there the efficiency, that a lot of pressure to cut costs, be more efficient, take advantage of new technologies, do you see that as in a way a benefit during this period? Well, we, I think we are forced to do that because uh, definitely the oil prices have an impact uh, on the industry and to be sustainable in this uh, uh, market condition we need to definitely increase the ability of produce internally. Uh, I see probably 2017 still at the same level of 2016 and uh, only the oil price fluctuation can uh, potentially provide a boost to the, to the industry to then go back uh, or two, three years ago. It's, it's now stable. It, to be quite honest, GCC in terms of uh, Middle East, uh, there are still a lot of projects uh, under uh, 
uh, development and uh, bidding and also awarding is not only UAE, but is Kuwait, Oman, Qatar and Saudi. They are very, very, um, uh, very. They are issuing a lot of tender and uh, um, awarding a lot of contract. So. We, we need to see for how long this uh, situation in the market can go ahead and definitely for us is an opportunity of trying to lean our organization, increasing the, the, the capacity of producing to then take a benefit uh, once the market will hopefully boost up and then probably increase the capacity of margin that we have on the market. Well, that sounds good and that's what we're all hoping yeah. for, Thank right? Thank you very much. Thank you.